Rick Perry organized the Task Force on Infectious Disease Preparedness and Response in 2014 during the rising concerns of Ebola. Daniel Owens, a resident of Bryan, is one of 11 new members who will be joining the task force on infectious disease preparedness and response. We're just 11 members who are being added to a bigger whole, uh, people who have already been serving on this task force for quite a while. Uh, and so right now we are the new people who are just serving at the pleasure of the governor. The members that make up this group hold a variety of leadership and executive positions to speak on behalf of their city. They created it to make sure there is a task force of people from multiple disciplines in order to make sure we have the best kind of uh, response and preparedness plan in Texas. Developing himself in the field of medicine in Bryan will give Owens the opportunity to speak on situations he has seen before. My role on, on the task force is mainly to just translate the, the EMS experience uh, from this area uh, into language for policymakers and decision makers. Citizens like Audrey are happy to see her small town gain the representation her people need. It's a smaller community and so to have representation is definitely always wanted. I think that we probably offer a really good um, perspective. Owens is proud of the EMS culture the city of Bryan has to offer and is humbled by the opportunity to represent a town he considers a hidden treasure. <laughs> It's actually a huge honor to be able to take that experience and to take those resources and be able to translate some of those experiences to the policy level with also working for the largest third service EMS system in the state. Now 44 members on the task force team will take part in advising the governor during critical health and safety situations of the state. The task force was found so useful it became a permanent service to advise the governor of Texas, passing the bill and effective immediately on June 19, 2015. Reporting in Bryan, Brittany DeFran, 25 News.